Hello there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with a stock swoosh, and I'm taking a look here at Target. Uh, this was a play of the day we did last week, and also I called a put in it last week. Both were the same day, uh, which was the day of the earnings. <clears throat> so I called the 119 puts in Target that expire this coming Friday, the 29th, and it had a really nice drop today. So when you're, when you're looking to do options, sometimes they take a couple days. Sometimes they go immediately on the same day. Sometimes they go in 24 hours, meaning you take it on a day and then it has a move the next day. Sometimes it takes a couple of days. And remember, this is a short week for the market. Uh, today's Tuesday, market was closed for Memorial Day. Anyways, going back here, this was the day that it fell down through here that I ended up calling it for the day trade and the option and I called the 119 puts and then it had the follow through here and here. But really the move here today was super duper because of the fact that again, 119 puts, this moved more than $4 to the strike. So that's a nice momentum. And again, this was a short because it was a put. <clears throat> so could this continue? Yes. Remember though, it's a short week. This could drop all the way down here, snug as a bug in this area, right in here to 112. But every day when you're in an option holding it, you really do have to have a big continued move because of the fact that you lose time value. So nice move in target. Overall, the retails have been the retailers have been falling, but this chart is still in an uptrend. So I called puts in this, but the chart's in an uptrend. This is still a strong stock. Um, you know, it's still holding very, very well. So if you're interested in the Gap Options newsletter, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. If you're interested in the next Golden Gap course, uh, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day, everyone.